Have you been surfing porn on the internet? Of course not. But if you have, you may have spyware. If your computer is running slow or you are seeing annoying pop-ups and flashing security alerts, you may have spyware. Spyware can steal your passwords and lead to identity theft. SuperAntiSpyware.com is a free download that anonymously detects and removes spyware, malware, trojans, key loggers. Super Anti Spyware is 100% free. Download Super Anti Spyware from SuperAntiSpyware.com. Sherdog.com here with Jason Lambert. Uh, you got to be feeling great. Knockout of the night, uh, win of the fight of the night. How are you feeling after your performance? Ah, oh, man, I feel great. You know, I, I worked my butt off um, training for this fight. You know, I didn't, I didn't cut any corners. Um, I did my sprints and my diet was on. Everything was on. You know, and and I felt super confident going into the ring. It's been a long time since you tasted defeat. You were on a you know a big win streak there, rolling through people on your entrance into the UFC. You ran into a little roadblock with Rashad Evans. I mean, a lot of people, including me, were questioning your confidence before the fight. How much did that eat away at you, or did it just drive you more to get back there on the winning side? Um, you know, it actually didn't really phase me much. You know, I put all that stuff aside, and um, I just knew what I had to do. You know, I, I have it in me. You know, I just have to unleash it, you know. And, and I think uh, my stand-up looked great tonight, you know, uh, for the little bit that I had, you know. But uh, he, he came out, like, shot out like a cannon, you know. Like, it was crazy. So we got right to it, you know. But uh, Babalu's a, a great win for me. So I just want to sit back and uh, enjoy that, you know. He did come out like he shot out of a cannon. Um, he was all over you quick early on. Um, kind of drove you back to the fence. Looked like he might have hurt you a little bit. Were you hurt there? No, I was, I was actually just shocked, you know, that I thought he was going to be a lot more tentative and, you know, throw more leg kicks and, and, you know, wait to see what I did. But he came, he didn't, he didn't phase, you know what I mean? I wasn't stunned or anything. He just, uh, you know, it was a good combo. He came in and overwhelmed and uh, got his takedown. But, you know, I just held it together and, and ended up getting out. A lot of people, uh, I don't know if they underestimate or just have never seen your ground skills. Uh, he had your back for a long time there in the first round. Uh, did you ever feel like you're in danger? No, you know, I mean, um, I'm not a slouch in jiu-jitsu, you know. I'm a brown belt, and, um, you know, I mean, obviously it's not a great place to be, but I, I was pretty sure that, you know, he wasn't going to submit me going into that fight. I knew that, you know, my submission skills would, would prevail and, and that I have, you know, really good defense. You had him hurt at the end of the first round. You came back. Um, I don't know if you won it on the judges' cards or not, but, you know, you after a tough first half of the round, you came back and dominated towards the end. Did you think you had him out of there before the bell rang? Yeah, you know, I, uh, I didn't think, I think I needed about 10 more seconds, you know. If I had 10 more seconds, I think that fight would have been over at the end of the first. Yeah. Talk about that left hook that finished him. Uh, he came in, looked like he was trying to throw a kick, and you caught him on a counter. Yeah, you know, it was great. Um, I didn't I didn't see it till after the fight, you know, the, um, the, the quick cam, you know, review, but... I just felt really relaxed, you know, my shoulders were, were loose and I wasn't pushing anything and, and it was just, you know, real crisp, it was just a reaction and, and I caught him right on the chin and, and it was a great strike, you know.